Hey everyone, here's how to create this outline effect on Spark AR. To start, we need a rectangle object. Rename this to Outline, and then on the right side, Fill Width and Fill Height, and create a material for it. Name this to Outline Matte, and change the shader type to Flat. On the texture section, click on this little arrow so that it converts it as a patch that we can then edit in the patch editor which as you can see pops up here. To prepare our patches, we're going to need a camera texture. So let's grab it from here on the camera, then click plus on texture extraction. Now we can drag in the camera texture from the assets panel to the patch editor. We also need the screen size information. So drag the device producer patch as well, which you can find on the top left. The last thing we need is the Sobel filter from the Spark AR library. So click Add Asset, search AR Library, and search for Sobel Filter. Click on Import Free and close this window once it's downloaded. And once again, drag it to the editor. Now we can start assembling. Connect the camera to the texture in Sobel Filter. Then grab the device screen size output. And we want to connect it here, but we need to divide the size first. Connect this to a swizzle patch with the swizzle set to RGB1. From the swizzle output, connect it to a mix and connect to the separate RGB and alpha channels. So the middle and the last one. Change the mix type to color with the arrow drop down. Finally, we connect it to the material texture. On the material properties, you can change the color and set the blend mode to either add subtract or screen. Just note that if you use subtract, it uses the opposite color from the color that you choose. I like to keep it on add to create this neon like effect. If you go on the divide value of the screen size and increase it, this is where you can adjust the outline thickness to your liking. I have two more variation ideas that you can include to your own filter that I want to show you guys. One thing you can do is offset the outline a little bit. To do this, select the outline rectangle, bring the scale up a tiny bit, let's say 1.05, and on the position, move the X and Y diagonally by a small amount. Let's move it a little bit to the right by 9 and down by 11. Just make sure on the viewport that you're staying within the rectangle. And now if I test this on my device, you can see that the outline is offset from the original position. One last variation you may want to include is by adding in a color cycle patch. We can find this on the AR library, so let's import it and drag it in. To make this work, connect the output of the color cycle to a blend patch and change the camera output to the destination of it. Change the blend mode to screen and connect it to the Sobel filter texture. Since we had this set to green, let's change it back to white so it would show all the colors. And there you have it. Now you can also change the duration of the speed it's changing. So let's make it slower by changing it to say four. If you have any questions, comment down below, and if you found this helpful, make sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more Spark AR tutorials. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys on my next video.